queen, I'm a queen morning beautiful ladies and the lord god bless you guys well it's another day we're all here the lord is good joy comes in the morning his mercies are new each day god is good all the time i'm just thankful for another day so thank you so much for tuning into this video you guys and hello to all new subscribers god bless you guys thank you for all the support the lovely comments I really want to start a godly fellowship here on the, for this channel. That's one of my goals for this channel. It's just to really connect with you guys and um, as sisters in Christ. And also to, um, even if you're not a believer, we can still connect. And I hope that um, one day you will allow the Lord Jesus into your heart because it's one of the best decisions I ever made personally. So I would like to encourage others as well who are not believers who are not born again so um god he offers the free gift of salvation for everyone it's not his will for anyone to perish but to have life and have it abundantly and god forgives and god cares for you so with that said um so you guys seen my little morning cleaning routine and i was as i was cleaning um the lord really talks to us right ladies it could be in that early morning hour the midnight hour all types of hours actually in the shower while we're driving our early morning cleaning routines our late night routines of cleaning or shopping and just in having that alone time with the lord and um the holy spirit led me to do a reading here for you guys and um, also for myself because the word of God is our bread, it's our food, and I just love God's word. So he led me to a virtuous woman, and we can find that, of course, in um, Proverbs 31. So I'm going to do a quick reading here, and I hope this really edifies you guys. I'm pretty sure it is. How could it not? It's the true living word of God. So chapter 31 of Proverbs talks about a virtuous woman. The words of King no, excuse me if I say some of these words wrong. Is it Lemuel, the prophecy that his mother taught him? What, my son, and what the son of my womb, and what the son of my vows? Give not thy strength unto women, nor thy ways to that which destroyeth kings. It is not for kings, O Lemuel, it is not for kings to drink wine, no, for princes strong drink lest they drink and forget the law and pervert the judgment of any of the afflicted. Give strong drink unto him that is ready to perish and wine unto those that be a heavy hearts. Let him drink and forget his poverty and remember his misery no more. Open thy mouth for the dumb and the cause of all such a as are appointed to destruction. Open thy mouth Judge righteously and plead the cause of the poor and needy. Who can find a virtuous woman? For her price is far above rubies. The heart of her husband doeth safely trust in her, so that he shall have no need of spoil. She will do him good and not evil all the days of her life. 
She seeketh wool and flax and worketh willingly with her hands. She is like the merchant ships. She bringeth her food from afar. She riseth also while it is yet night and giveth meat to her household and a portion to her maidens. She considereth the field and buyeth it. With the fruit of her hands, she planteth a vineyard. Proverbs thirty-one seventeen. She girdeth her loins with strength and strengthened her arms. She perceiveth that her merchandise is good. Her candle goeth not out by night. She layeth her hands to the spindle and her hands hold the distaff. She stretched out her hand to the poor. Yea, she reaches forth her hands to the needy. She is not afraid of the snow for her household, for all her household are clothed with scarlet. She maketh herself coverings of tapestry. Her clothing is silk and purple. Her husband is known in the gates when he sitteth among the elders of the land. She maketh fine linen and selleth it and delivereth girdles unto the merchant. Strength and honor are her clothing and she shall rejoice in time to come. She openeth her mouth with wisdom, and in her tongue is the law of kindness. She looketh well to the ways of her household, and eateth not the bread of idleness. Her children arise up and call her blessed, her husband also, and he praiseth her. Many daughters have done virtuously, but thou excelleth them all. Favor is deceitful, and beauty is vain, but a woman that fear of the Lord shall be praised. Give her of the fruit of her hands and let her own works praise her in the gates. Amen.